Monday yeah. night, one of my favourite nights of the week, because Rogie comes down and we do the potty. Welcome to the pod vlog, Rog. Ah, thanks for having me, McDonald. I thought you were going to say it's your favourite night because you have AFL 360. We have on the couch, but of course, that all gets pushed aside <laughs> for the sake of the back pocket bloker. Yeah, exactly right. Big night for the uh, for all footy shows. It's a bit of a show. It's quite funny we always talk about. We break the stories on, yeah. on the back pocket plug up. Like, the amount of stuff that we come out with, and then when we watch AFL 360, they regurgitate it. Absolutely. It's, it's ridiculous. They're clearly listening to the podcast before it's even been put out. So, I don't, <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm not sure, yeah. And then when the pod comes out on Wednesday, it just looks like we've just copied. I know, we haven't. I did this time, this week, I was so upset it comes off to the dogs that I haven't even listened to SEN or any of the shows at all this weekend. So yep. everything that's coming to you will be personal. completely unfiltered. It will not be have gone through the uh, bias eyes of, of the of the professionals. It'll be a purely back pocket plugger uh, opinion. Beautiful. Uh, we're going to go get a feed. We always get a pre-pod feed. We're going to go to the pub today. Yeah, usually it's Indian. Um, mm. But then we have strayed into some uncharted territories. But this week, we're going in and sitting in at a pub. Going to the pub. Which probably means there won't be a podcast at all this week. It'll probably, <laughs> <laughs> probably be there. If you haven't seen the pod, that's the reason. Yeah. Just a pre-potty feed. I went the mushroom burger because it was just about the only veg option there. <laughs> and let me tell you, I don't reckon this is going to fill me. I think we'll have to stop somewhere on the way home to get the top up. Maybe at Daniel's Donuts on the way home. Uh, maybe. But last time we <laughs> ate that, I was constipated for the next four nights, so I think we might refrain. We're not getting donuts, are we? No, we couldn't get donuts. <sighs> Alright, we'll get some donuts. We'll get some donuts. We'll get a couple of donuts. What are they called again? Daniel's Donuts. Daniel's Donuts. We got a six pack last time. I don't think we'll be doing that again. We don't need. We don't <laughs> that need six pack sat there for about a week and a half, and oh. I was nibbling for for a good chunk of that week. I had one, and I felt like I was about to die. So we'll. Um, I'm, I'm not sure whether I'm going like a full creamy one, like a real cus uh, uh, custody. If we're getting donuts, you're going all out. I'm not going there for an original glaze. I want the I want the full shebang, and I'm reckon I'm going to get a hot chocolate or a cup coffee as well. Okay, cool. Some people would probably see this pod as a bit of a uh, you know sort of masquerading as podcasters when really we're just food entrepreneurs. But um, yeah, that's not true. Well, that's pretty much. You that's know. unfair. Well, on the YouTube, you've almost transitioned from a football channel to a let's put a butter chicken on chips channel. <laughs> <laughs> it's only fair uh, we do well, it in the real world as well. Where's the integrity coming <laughs> <laughs> Options galore, Roger. The Nutella hot chocolate's doing a bit for me. I think that might have to be the... Well, I think their hot chocolates are of the alcohol. Where do you take uh, Max Brenner. I think they're on the, of the alcohol. Max Brenner's on the way of the dodo, so if this can sort of compensate for that loss... Then so. donuts could be the new place. Double D's. <laughs> the best double D's I've ever seen. Cheesecake's like my favourite dessert, so to have it in a donut, sort of the fusion, I've, I've made the right call here. <laughs> I've definitely made the right call. They didn't have mine, they didn't have just the original glaze, which is, oh, I'm so boring. Like, I love a vanilla ice cream, I love a vanilla... I thought you said coming into this you wanted something filled with like a cream or something. Yeah, I was looking for a cream, but they had like a cheesecake one, but they didn't have like just a no, cream that one. that is, I suppose, it, yeah. <laughs> I've settled for the glaze jam. Mm. <laughs> Happy day. You ever had a Queen Vic Market jam donut? No. It's a different gravy, mate. Mm. Like, if you think of South Melbourne, have you ever had a South Melbourne dim sim? No. Yeah. What a South Melbourne dim sim is to a regular dim sim, uh, times that by 45, and you've got what a uh, Vic Market jam donut is to a regular jam donut. Wow. Like. At, some, at some point, the body will be done. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, donuts and hot chocolates consumed. And now it's potty o'clock. How do you think that sits uh, so far in terms of sort of pre-game meals we, we've indulged in? Well, I was craving a palmy, so... <clears throat> palmy. Is that a good palmy? Yeah. Yeah, good palmy. Well, that don't seem convincing. I still I still reckon... I still think the Malai Kofta from Indian. I was going to say, I think curry is probably our best pre-pod meal yeah. at the moment. Yeah. And, and the most frequent as well. It's got the most runs on the board. Yeah. And the runs look best off the bat as well, so... Yep, so we might have to go to a curry next week. Go back to a curry, yep. Comment down below, curry, Hungry Jacks, or pub right, feed? Roger's writing down some topics, I'm just setting everything up. Don't show them. We don't, <laughs> don't show them. We can't have them find out in advance. It's top secret material, otherwise AFL 360 on the couch will get a hold of it and steal our thunder again. This is the view that we have. Just turn the, the computer on. Turn the radio panel on. These are called um, buttons. Faders. Faders. That's uh, radio school, $8,000. <laughs> That's what it gets you. <laughs> <laughs>
planning is coming to an end. All the Scotty cams are in place. And we're just about ready to go. Yeah, ready. <clears throat> All right, I'll clap this in, Bailey. Three, two, one. Three, two. Three, two. <laughs> the multiple clap. <laughs> Just sort of sync them all up. All right. We love this shit, we love the grind. Fucking nice, we do. That's what we're born to do. G'day guys and welcome back to the Back Pocket Plug Up Podcast. Uh, myself, Cad McDonald, is joined by co-host of the show, Connor Rogers. Rog, how are you, mate? Yeah, it's good to be back live the in the studio. After doing the potty, Rog, how'd we go? Uh, I think that's probably the best episode yet. It's just coming off the... You know when Steve Smith finds his hands and yeah. all of a sudden he's just hitting boundaries every every shot? I reckon we're there. I reckon we found our hands. Well, I agree. It, it's, you know... We were right here all this time. <laughs> <laughs> we're, we're six episodes in, but um, yeah, it's starting, yeah, starting to feel good off Mind the Mind you, we were never struggling. I don't think the first couple episodes it was clunky at all but it's just clockwork at the moment it is clockwork um we're gonna pack up we're gonna upload the footage we send it off to bailey from ballarat um and he'll whip up the pod for us and then we're gonna play hours and hours of fifa absolutely hopefully i get a win this time i'm yet to get a w against you this year so the potty is done and dusted everything's packed up and now it's time for fifa while a bit of AFL 360 gets put on. Let's see what they've stolen from us this week. I think as I grow old, I'll reflect on these times for some of the best of my life. <laughs> we bottle it up. Sorry. Yeah. No, exactly. It could be a quick night for oh, Roger. We're, uh, we're in struggle town. <laughs> Go on, boys. We're done and dusted with FIFA. We're into the couch. And it's almost bedtime, to Roggy. Glad to get a W on the board with the FIFA. Disappointed to have three or four L's on the board, but glad to finally break the ducks for the year. No, you've done well. You've done well. It's almost bedtime. We'll leave the pod vlog here. Appreciate all support. Appreciate everyone watching. Keep plugging those back pockets. And tune into the podcast, which will be out tomorrow. Cheers, guys.